Welcome with Mr. Tolly's class. Hey there, this is Ian, and I'm going to show you where you can find the term two report cards and also the spot you're going to find all the report cards moving forward. Where you're going to start here on the PowerSchool main page, you're going to click data and reporting. Under data and reporting, you're going to go to reports. Here at the top, you're going to see compliance reports. You're going to click that. All right, and here you're going to see an area called compliance reports. Previously, I believe the section was called provincial reports, but essentially you find all the same information here, such as index cards, etc. You're then going to scroll down under paper reports. In this case, I'm going to be uh, clicking on elementary report cards 7 to 8. Um, I could also click elementary report cards 1 to 6 or kindergarten communication of learning report card. Now what we're going to be doing is look at what you need to do with the 1 to 8 report card that is grade 1 to 8. It says here this is for the grade 7 and 8 report card, but these instructions apply also to 1 to 6. So based upon the instructions that we were provided, uh, there's a few different pieces of information you need to put in. Now, reminder that here under uh, the student selection, if you're doing just a class and you have those students selected, click this. If you're doing all students, you click all students. Now, you're going to make sure here under store code, you're going to have um, R2 next to store code for report period 2. Print date, what we've been instructed to do is June 30th, as you see here. Make sure you have all pages selected. Also, co-teacher. After which point, you click Submit, which will then prepare it for printing. Now, if you happen to be doing a kindergarten report card, many of the same rules apply. If you are here, again, if you're just doing a class and you've selected that class, make sure that this box is selected. If you're doing all students, select this box. For store code, ensure that you have, as you see here, report two. Scrolling down a little bit, ensure that you have report card date as June the 30th. Below that, for pages to print, make sure you have all pages. Scrolling down a little bit further, again, code teacher is selected. And in this case, because it's kindergarten, make sure your ECE is selected. Okay, that's all for me. Good luck out there printing your report cards.